Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Dark Souls 2. We are at the Huntsman's Cuffs. And it's immediately dark. All so high. Oh, yeah, you. Leave me alone. I'm interested in one thing. Right, I forgot about you. Right, that's how I got here. Okay, moving on up to an area we haven't been to. I wonder how difficult this place will be, considering it's the main path, and I went ahead and did a bunch of other things first. Whoa. Okay. Pathetic. What the... Something's moving down there. What the hell was that? There's nothing behind me either. Oh, moths. You all right there, buddy? I don't even know what to make of this. Gorgeous. That is really beautiful. Yep. Thought I heard something. Haunted house, I guess. But I heard something. Okay. Oh, there you are. And he's a relatively quick draw, too. Let's try. Whoa. Hi. Where the hell did you come from? Life gem, thanks. Rogue armor. Yep. Oh, that's what I heard. What an existence. Finally makes it up top and then this happens. Well, that's how I came in. There's a ladder. And here's the way of... Whoa! Yup. Why am I not surprised? I'll take that cracked red eye orb that I don't really care about, though. Man, that forest just goes on forever. Also, this may sound stupid, but... Turns out it's worth it going here. This knife. F 
finally, that shut him up. Solo Nemo Soldier and Life Gen. Well, what is this? How many guys are just hanging around this pit? Are we done? Well, that takes care of exploring this house, so I think we're good. I think. This appears to be a different area. Wow, some jump. Dual wielding, huh? Easy to kill, but they're pretty dangerous. Poison moss and life gem. Where do I fall? I'm not trapped here, am I? No, I'm not. It actually didn't hurt that badly. Okay. This pretty much covers this area. Now I can move on to the, the way I already went. Where? Someone clearly jumped off of something. I don't know. That was weird. Nothing? That is probably the way forward. And this is probably a shortcut. There's a bonfire. Nothing. All right. And after killing all those guys, they were still worth under 2,000 souls. Not very impressive. Also, this is apparently worth getting. If I can get it. Ooh, I don't know about that jump, though. I don't know, man. Yeah, that does not look good. But apparently I can get there, so I need to see about this. Okay, that is a very convenient shortcut indeed. Someone chasing me? It's hard to tell. Whoa! Goodness gracious. And yes, someone was chasing me. Good job, idiot. Now you're dead. And you. Don't scare me. there is something to this. There we go. Do I really need to land on it just right? Because that's not cool. That's super not cool. I don't even mind. That's fine. How the hell do I make this work? Do I go for the tall ledge? I don't think I can land on that. Do I just go for the right ledge and hope I land on it correctly? Uh, ooh -ho 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 -ho. 
Pharos Lockstone, and a token of fidelity. I think this might even be like the only one I can naturally find in the game, which is crazy. Uh, nope. Or maybe, yup. Yeah, no, I thought I was at the bonfire area. Clearly I was mistaken. God, that's creepy. Nope. Monastery charm is soul of a proud knight. No poison for me. I think we've seen a monastery charm before. Yeah, cures poison and restores HP. Very necessary in a place like this, I think. Although apparently I do want to be in here. I can drop. That's insane. That is insane that they expect me to do that. Was that a grub down there? How am I going to do this? I'm here, now what? Or is that just the ground below? Holy crap! You are too big. That is freaking terrifying. Uh, I'll try this, but I'm not happy. Don't care. Kiss, kiss, please. Large Titanite Shard times three. Cool. And I'm out of the drink. Poison wears off pretty damn quickly, huh? Rickard's Rapier. We've seen that before. Oh, that was scary. An exquisitely decorated rapier, said to belong to a prince who appears in an ancient tale. There are numerous variations of the story of the prince who wandered the lands and eventually became undead. The majority of these tales end in tragedy, but there are some exceptions. Now, there is a way to leave without a homeward bone. Ha ha! There wasn't even a prompt to interact with it, you could just do it. Large soul of an evil soldier, and we have a demon's dark soul, uh, elevator thing. Well, that was worth it. Absolutely. Secrets. Oh, we're here again. No more archer. Cool moves, but didn't help. Not any cool moves. Super duper did not help. Not cool moves, it kind of did help.
Also, it turns out those guys were hanging by the edge of the hole the whole time. Huh. The more you know. Well, I'm out. Cool. Got through the, uh, the secret area of the Huntsman's Cops. just fall and deal with it. Pretty forgiving in terms of fall damage though, and I've already unlocked a shortcut. So I can just go. Or I can die, that's fine too. Well that was stupid, but the bonfire is right here, so it's not much of an inconvenience. How embarrassing. I was right here. I'm very good at video games. Oh, there you were. No wonder I got ambushed. Well, now I can move on, I guess. God damn, that scares me every time. Sorry, buddy, still invincible. I'm undefeatable. Oh. There you go. The place is a little bit quieter. Now, how do I get up there? You'd think the ladder kind of would have been it, right? I don't think there was anything concerning the, the top of the house other than the path I actually took. Too late, buddy. Whoa. There we go. Small yellow burr, hello. Small blue burr, what? Temporarily boost magic defense. These birds bloom magnificently on a shrub every few years. Their color and effect determined by soil quality and recent weather. Known to have been used in rituals long ago. And temporarily boost lightning defense. Um, okay, thanks guys. Okay, well we reached the top of the house and now what? Here we are. Yeah, how do I, oh, right. Forgot about you. Ah, crap. I can't just walk up here, can I? No. See, my next goal is supposed to be that bridge. But how do I get there? Oh, I can just go this way. Don't I feel like a genius? But first... There we go. Didn't fool me that time. Yep, no one chasing me to my knowledge. Small blue burr. Someone just dropped down, I think. Maybe no one jumped down. I don't know. It's 
small orange burr, and a soul, of course. Fire defense. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. Blue is magic, yellow is lightning, orange is fire. Of course. Whoa. Also, what is this, dark roof? This place is creepy. Whoa, okay, I'll just be over here. What the hell? Those things are sick, what? This Mad Max guy with his giant sickle side thing? Wow. There we go. Interesting, I have a different animation for big guys. Glad he's gone. But then he has his torch-wielding friend over here. What? I'm poisoned. That's cool. I don't even know where that came from. Obviously a moth, but where did that come from? Although now that I'm looking at the bar, poison goes away pretty quickly. So that explains that. Poison really messes you up, though. It hurts a lot more quickly, but it goes away a lot more quickly. Oh, there you are. Moths actually in the trees. Great. You know, I wonder. Oh, it just immediately dies. I didn't even see how many souls that gave, unfortunately. But it's cool to know that I can kill them quickly. Even if that was an iron arrow. Oh, poison moss. How appropriate. Well, it looks like I actually want that stuff now that I'm dealing with this place. Nope. What? A dark spirit? Come on. Guess I'm dealing with this now. Got him. Or er, almost. Got him. What you have for me? <sighs> Another effigy. I, you get poisoned like nothing flat. The thing is, even going to cure the poison is probably like... Uh, I'll do it. So by the time I cure the poison, like, I've already taken most of the damage from it. Look at that. Like, half my damn health? Alright. I guess I'll do this. I can equip up to three right-hand weapons? That's crazy. Ah, uh, but it does encumber me. Something fierce, though. Yeah, no, that's a problem. Yeah, it takes care of that. More poison moths. Watch out for those moths, I swear to God. I gotta watch out for moths at all times in this nightmare over here. He is alone. Didn't work. But he goes down easily enough. Drops a life gem. Aromatic ooze. Okay.
this weird little hut over here. I'm just always looking up now for moths, so that's cool. How the hell do I get in there? The ceiling? Well, I'm back. This is the bridge, right? Is this a different hut? With a guy in it? Somebody saw me. And he's getting the hell out. Damn, that guy booked it. Where the hell did he go? I'm not seeing any moths though. So much for what they say about moths that a flame, right? Oh, oh, hello. What the hell hit me so hard? Oh. Hm, the dogs can drop human effigies. Probably gotta find a way to activate that bridge. Ah, there we go. Now this works. Big night. He does not hurt very much. Goodbye. Green Blossom. Soul, soul Spear. Where's the magic section? I guess I'll have to go here. Sorcery that fires souls shaped into a spear. Pierces enemies causing heavy damage. This spell was said to have been devised by Master Sorcerer, but his name is long forgotten. Poison Moss and Green Blossom. Sublime Bone Dust. Very good, very good. Oh. There we go. I'm out. Is there a way I can get into the other dome? How do I do that? Oh, hi. No, for real. What the hell is go- You are fat. What is the- Like, what the hell was that? Life gem, but what the hell was that? What was that all about? It was weird. Oh, this is just open. There's the lever. Figured it out. I wonder what this does. Yep. I obviously pissed somebody off. There we go. Did it. That looks intimidating. Okay, just nothing. Pile of flaming bodies. A 
dome I cannot enter, but it has a freaking bonfire. So that's not cool. And before I deal with this, let's just take a look back at the earlier area one more time. Yeah, I thought so. There were two bridges, and that one I haven't touched. Whoa! I have no idea where you came from. Crap. Wait, what? What am I targeting? Is there a moth above me? There is, actually. Let's just play a safe. Threat eliminated. Twilight Herb, nice, thank you. Ugh, I only have one Estus Flask left. Not very good. Yeah, this was the new bridge, right? I think. Yeah. Or did I just never go forward and get this thing? No, this is just open now. Okay. A morning star. Beautiful. A club fitted with a spiked head. The spikes of this blunt weapon cause bleeding. Normally wielded by clerics, but clearly intended to draw blood. Well, okay, I did that, but... I guess I need the other stone bridge. So what did I miss here? Whoa, whoa. You can calm down right now. Whoa. Hang on. Glad that's over. Oh, good. That freaking hurt. What? That was weird, just a little leap of nothing. But you're done. And now I'm out of Estus, so that's cool. Guess I'll set my 28 life gems. Unbelievable. Are we... Really? We're doing this now. A notched whip. A whip covered in spikes. Shreds skin and causes bleeding. Very effective against bare flesh, but not against enemies with armor or like protection. That's right, I did see- oh, wow. Wow, I'm not prepared for this. Are you kidding me right now? I, like, four? Are you freaking kidding me? You know what? They might not be so bad if I can get them on the bridge. If I could even make it to the damn bridge. Oh my god. That was not- Okay. That was not the backstab I hoped it would be. Goodbye. Hey, I know. Let's go to the other bridge. Jeez. No mercy.
can I make it happen for only one of them? There's my question. Uh, <laughs> wow, I equipped the wrong weapon. I meant to aggro that one guy, but I guess we're doing this now. Whew, did it. No mercy, for God's sake. These guys are relentless, but I got just one of them. That's the important thing. Now, I'm not going to get four of them chasing me. Maybe I'll just get three. I see. Good enough. That actually really hurt him. You are by yourself, correct? With that crazy blackened whip? What the hell even is that? Good. Cracked red eye orb, I don't care. Now where were your friends? Oh. Got him. This is what you get for kicking my ass before. How do you like me now? Come on. Too bad. We cool? One more? No? Aha! And you're a whip guy. Not so bad anymore. And dead. Well, that was scary. Freaking ridiculous. Ho, 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 ho. Tricky, tricky. See you in hell. But now there's this bridge. Right, so the culmination is kind of here. scary but undead purgatory and immediately a black phantom that's cool doesn't even spawn in it's just here whoa that's fine oh my god I don't know if your weapon's crazy enough dude Wonderful. Okay, let's try this again. Soul get, thank God. This guy's a freaking tank. I thought my shield was big. Apparently I haven't seen anything. Oh my God, that sword is stupidly big. Right. Okay. What? Where did you even come from? How fast could that spirit possibly be? He is coming at quite the clip. Wait, he just. Oh, okay, he did not vanish. But I'll take his idiot undead friends. 
super not excited about fighting the spirit on a bridge, though. That's, like, way worse than what I already had to deal with. Yeah, if you want to... Hmm. I was kind of hoping you'd follow me back to the Huntsman's Cops. Really was kind of hoping that. But if he's going to retreat to his own place, then I'm okay with... Yeah, I'm, I'm okay with this. I only ran away to heal, so this is tolerable. Let's try this again. Without the peanut gallery chipping in. Can I... Mm? Nope. I tried. Oh, thank God. That'll save me time. <laughs> And health. Nope. God, this guy's sword swings or something else. Wham, it's over. Wham. Oh, thank God, it's over. That was scary. Why did nothing happen when I killed him? Was that, like, not even a boss level enemy? And then there's this. Eh. Not really happy about this. Good. A fire seed. Well. Alright. What I will do, though, because I'm not going to go through that door. Not just yet. I need to get rid of these souls now. Oh, that was scary. Okay, first things first. Let's improve our Estus Flask. Second, let's level up. God, leveling up's getting expensive. But I'm so strong. And now, back to the Huntsman's Cops, the bridge approach. Alright, well now that we made it back here, that sure was a lot, it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We explored a whole bunch of the Huntsman's Cops. We're only really missing that giant iron bridge. Otherwise, we went into undead purgatory? It really didn't take long to find the mist door, though. It was just a small hallway through there. But it was a very well-guarded one. Whatever's behind that mist door must be something special. Until next time, everyone.